We're gonna check the air tightness difference with and without a fireplace. We're gonna temporarily seal up this fireplace and um, because the owner is actually thinking of um, changing it to a different solution uh, anyway. So we're gonna tape it up, check the air tightness difference of this property with and without a fireplace. Again, this home was built in the 1950s, so it's gonna be really interesting to see the results and the, the air tightness uh, difference between the fireplace being open and completely closed. We're getting a 10 ACH differential with and without this, uh, this fireplace taped up. So in summer, it's gonna to contribute to significant air leakage where it's gonna be a lot, a lot harder to keep a cooler living area in this property. But in winter, it also works against you when you're not using the fireplace, which in many occasions, uh, in today's day and age, we don't use fireplaces very often. So this is basically a big chimney and it's gonna be moving a lot of the heat from the ducted heating system or the split system. If they're using that, all that heat is basically just leaving the building envelope. So in many sort of ways, I think the fireplace is a legacy heating system that potentially needs to be re-evaluated.